Hi guys, and um, welcome to my video. I just want to show you the work of my latest journal. Um, it's not finished, but I just want to show you what I've done so far. Um, now I've uh, chose a beautiful scarf as a cover. Instead of gluing it on, I just used um, paper clips. And I actually do quite like the way it uh, just hangs naturally. Um, that charve, um, scarf was bought a charity shop, but so it was a gorgeous. So I was going through my um, fabrics and I just wanted to use some of them up basically. Um, so that's the cover. Um, there's some, these are the embellishments that I again got from a charity shop. That's fabric um, that I dyed. Um, so is it a bit of a collage? Um, they're main, they're ma mainly collage pages so far. Um, that's the one with the heart. I did a slight um, Christmas theme there. Um, again, it was a collage, a collage of paper and fabric and washi tape. So, um, and again, the fabric, I dyed that fabric. Um, and there's um, and more collages there. Again, that's more embellishment I got from the package in the charity shop. Um... This one's really sweet. I like this with the teapot. I thought that was really sweet. Um, got a bit of a power, you know, slight power steam there because the paper was power steamed. Um, I like that one because I feel it tells a story. You know, what is she thinking about? You know, and I thought that's why the heart went well, nice as well. You know, is she thinking about a lover or? So it gets you. There's a bit of a story there. It gets you thinking. Um, there's another collage. Um, yeah, this was lovely fabric that I picked up because it feels like cord. It feels really soft, but it also feels like cord. So I got that off a local, um, we're lucky to have, um, a, f um, a lovely, uh, sewing, uh, sewing shop called Kutch. Um, and she does beautiful fabrics, really, you know, really lovely fabrics. So she had a sale on her fat quarters so i uh bagged some of that so um these are cute with the foxes that's my, that's a fat quarter that i bought um when i visited west wales to see my mum and um, they're so cute those foxes i just love them um and uh the rest of, i thought i'd do something a bit with teared paper uh you know um teared card sorry so yeah, did um did uh did that as well because there's some green card at the side. I put both sides. I put the green card. Um, now again, this this is um this was uh this is another collage. Um, I used packaging from Taperology, because uh, I ordered some stuff for that, which I was really pleased with. Um, and they had this lovely cardboard packaging, so I thought I'd use that as a collage because I do like the black and white. I thought that was quite nice. Um, again, this was, um, and they gave, actually, Tablology gave me some lovely stickers for free, which are coffee stickers. Um, and there's some words there as well. Again, that was the paperback, paper pack from the charity. And again, more of them. I thought they were nice on their own, actually, hence, you know, because they, they're so pretty. And I've, I've almost sort of done them. Um, I got some vellum paper. I just do plain vellum added there. Again, there's ones there. Again, I love the stick of the deck chair. Um, and yeah, beautiful ones there as well. Um, and again, that, that's another collage. Um, another collage there. And again, using the um, stickers. Um, now, this is my recent one. And um, this is beautiful gold vellum paper that I got. Um, I went quite busy on that one. I did ink that one as well, which I thought was nice. Um, and so you've got the gold, beautiful shade. Um, and then you've got that as well. So again, uh, more stick. And they, they were the last ones then um, that I used up. Now I did a bit of uh, tea dyeing with vellum. Um, as you can see, and I thought I'd do, and I got this lovely, um, scripture vellum paper, 
and basically just tea dyed it and I thought it made a nice effect. You could even use it as a pocket and keep something in there um, if you wanted. Again, and again, that was the Paris related paper. Um, and I love this. This is a saying that um, when you have more than you need, build a longer table, not a higher fence. So in other words, you know, it's um, invite. It's about inviting the right people in your life. You know, people which will lift you. You know, um, you know, um, when times at when when times are good and bad, and they just be there for you. You know, and you know that's the sort of positive influence you know you need in your life. And you know, and don't you know. And yeah, just being friendly and approachable, you know, because um, uh, quite often if you shut yourself down, the people around you, you know, will shut themselves off from you. So, and uh, now here's, um, <laughs> I think this is like the closest I've got to a pocket really, but I bought these um, pockets in the works, only 50p. And again, I use my lovely script vellum. And that's a that's and then I use the stamp for a basket and then a flower in the middle and that says peace. Again, positive messages we're looking for. That's tea dyed paper. Um, and I got a sense of a church window there as well, which I thought looked nice in the background. There's another one. Enjoy again vellum paper. And it made quite an interesting effect. I didn't purposely um smudge um the vellum paper, but. As I was doing some of the tea dye, I think it must have got on then. I didn't realise it made the ink stain, but it's actually quite an interesting effect. And there's one on love. Um as um again a pocket. Um again with script uh, again with scripture. Um I think, yeah, because I got some um um and this is the this is vanum paper again. Um as you see, it's got the lovely go tint, and I thought the um, I thought the the, ma the mahogany uh, Tim Holtz ink color was gorgeous. As I thought it went lovely against the gold vellum, um, and basically says everyone is welcome. We rise by lifting others, and and yeah, I mean that, and you know, I mean that's what God does. You know, He lifts you up, and you know, and the thing is, you know, you want to share that. You want to share that good news. Um, hence why the this is from taper uh, ology wash uh, newspaper washi tape that I got very recently, and and I thought again that was quite appropriate. You know the good news, like you know, so newspaper, um, there, um, it's a part of the um, Tim Holtz inspired paper, um, making your own Tim Holtz. Um, now what I used, I used a. Advertise. Um, my mum gets these free ad, you know, the magazine full of adverts, basically. So I teared that, and I, I know Tara takes. Um, we were doing some. Um, uh, where you scrunch up a piece of paper and then you ink it to make it look like you know leather, and I thought that went really nice on top of the paper. Um, and I love that figure right at the top there as well. And there's a very faint ink outline of a girl as well, you know, like she's watching that person on the top. So again, um, so that is, so basically you can do your own Tim Holtz paper, you know, just, basically you can use any newspaper, it doesn't have to be advertisement, you know, get some paper, tea dye, tea dye it or coffee dye it and keep layering it, laying, laying it so, you know, you've got a good layer and then add whatever effect you like. I mean, in, instead of, me doing the the uh, leather uh, fox look um you know you could do stamps instead because Tara takes did did use stamps when she did her Tim Holtz make make your own Tim Holtz paper um and yeah it was it was, it was effective and and this is another one this is the um this is again more vellum paper now the ink didn't settle as well on the vellum paper, on the gold vellum paper, it didn't really settle that well, unfortunately. So there's only like tiny, very small smidgens you can see of the of the mahogany ink that I used. Um I got a little um got that was psalm there. Um the earth is the Lord's could say it does belong to God and we need to cherish it and look after it. Um and then this and then this is a page, basically, the Lord's Prayer is my anchor. And that is basically um, paper. And then I used, 
And this is a, a lovely washi tape that I picked up in a charity shop, actually. Two rolls of it for a pound. And it, it's really nice. It's got a lovely quality to it. Um, and then... And then basically, now that's that's on tracing paper. And as you can see, that turns out much better, the leather effect, than it does on the golden vellum. So that, that really comes out strongly on the tracing paper. Um, and again, you know, I bend them. So again, you could use that as a bit of a pocket. Yeah, so that is my that is the journal so far. I mean, I mean, as you can see, I mean, I, you know, I have got, oh, there's just a little backing that I did, but. As you can see, I've got quite a lot of pages to go, so, you know. Um, but the thing is, you know, I'm taking my time with it, so there's no rush. And, you know, and, and the thing is, you know, I'm, and because it is, again, you know, again, it's going to be another reference journal, you know. Again, you know, put my designs in and everything. It's, you know, hence that's why I want to take my time with it as well. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I really um, I need to get back downstairs because it's I don't know where you are guys, but it's 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 hot in the UK in Wales. It's hot. So I hope you're all coping with the heat. Um, remember, drink lots of water, and stay in the shade. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, thank you. Thank you for your support as always. Bye.